I don't care about your failures. I, want, I don't care about how many times you're gonna fail before you're gonna fix it. It's okay to make the mistake. A thousand failures for one success and then build on it. Get it done. Okay, you guys are here. It's not good enough just to be here though, right? Commitment and doing things that are on the hop is an attitude, it's an approach, it's the way you attack things. There's no doubt that Doug, like many of the great ones, and the great ones possess this, they're like, they're thoroughbred. Doug was a thoroughbred. He has this passion uh, that stems from growing up as the youngest of four boys with great people ahead of him and his family to learn from, but then he, he would constantly say to himself, I gotta do this on my own. I said, are you gonna be as good as your brothers? He looked at me like he wanted to kill me. He said to me, I'm going to be better than my brothers. His drive was uh, unbelievable to, to be successful. Um, you know, obviously there were some stumbling blocks, but that made him grow as an athlete. Playing two sports was not easy. My decision was to play two. I scared off many, many schools in football and especially in lacrosse to be the first Tawara Don winner, which is the Heisman of lacrosse, be considered for the New York Jets at the very last cut, to win gold medal in the World Games, to play just about at every level and be successful, you know, that's Doug Chanahan. So Mr. Shanahan's got to take control. He's maybe the, one of the best players on Long Island. Going to Hofstra next year to play football and lacrosse. Up top, now Shanahan will rifle it home. The date was Tuesday, July 9th. Team USA and their superstar midfielder, Doug Shanahan. Some of the best athletes in Long Island history, you have Carl Ustrzemski, obviously the Boston Red Sox great, Julius Irving, uh, Jim Brown, Hall of Famer Craig Biggio. I mean, you talk about one of the best athletes to ever come off of Long Island, and you have to think about Doug Shanahan. Playing the NFL for the team he grew up following the Jets. Doug Shanahan, the former Hofstra star, was a two-time All-American honorable mention. He was just an unbelievable athlete, unbelievable player. He could see things before anybody else saw them, and you couldn't help but be jealous of this guy's talent. When I come back to Hofstra, uh, it's a good place in my heart that I give back to the place that's done so much for me.